hello friends today in this tutorial i will be showing you that how basically you can upload a video which is present inside your google drive to directly to youtube as a private or public video accordingly so you can see that this is my youtube channel here Bas basically it con doesn't contain any video out there no video is present now let me uh, run this google app script basically google app script is just a platform where you can directly interact with all the google api such as google drive uh, youtube api gmail api spreadsheet so you can see this is my video here which is hosted on google drive and basically i need to directly upload this video to youtube as a private video so you will need this uh, video id guys of this uh, google drive video so anytime basically if you upload a video here let me show you you select that video and right click at and simply click on get link so you will get this link of this video guys basically if you just copy this link and paste it in the browser and basically you just need this id here which is there this is the id that you see for every video so simply copy this id guys and simply we need to paste this id here which is this id you will see that so here inside this code i will paste it and then basically the privacy status you will see it is private and if i now run this script here basically it will it will run this script and execution started you will see that and now after that it will return me you can see if i refresh it basically a video will be there here automatically published here you will see the title is summer vacation you can see whatever title that we need to give here 95 processing and you will see it will be a private video so you will see that after processing is complete it will label this visibility as private so automatically our video is uploaded guys to youtube you don't need to manually do this process so it's very simple so it's just processing it and uh, then the visibility will change to the private you will see that if you see this the details section and basically you will see uh, the title you can customize the title here you can change the description of the video you can even put tags here category id and then you can put the private status so then we are simply using the insert method guys of the youtube data api which offers this uh, direct method to upload it to the youtube you will see now it changed to private here so you can see uh, what private video simply means that this video will not appear on your channel or search results only you have the access to view this video so you can even uh, just directly publish a public video as well if i open this on youtube you will see that this is a video and which is hosted here you will see that now it is 16 second video is there so very simple process you need to simply run the script google app script if you want to directly publish videos from your google drive directly to youtube as a private video so i have given this source code in the description of this video guys so if you want to read all the blog post step by step instruction is given here and all the source code is also given so if you really want to get this source code go to the description of this blog post so now let me start building the script guys as i already told you this these are all google apis so google has developed specifically google app script for writing directly interacting with google apis so it's a special scripting platform and all that code is similar to javascript if you know javascript you can write code here simply go to here and click on start scripting and here we need to create a brand new project here guys so simply click on brand new project and here we can start our coding process so it's very simple so we will write a function here which will be called as upload video to youtube so this is a function you can name this function anything accordingly just make your function after this guys we will get the source file video file that we need to save and for this guys we need to use the drive app basically this is the api of google drive and it contains a lot of methods you can get the video file or any sort of file by its id this is a method which is used here drive file sorry drive app dot get file by its id so again i have shown you how to get the id so simply copy this id here if you want to upload this so simply i will paste this id so after this we will simply now to get this blob object guys it's very simple now to get the blob object we will simply invoke a method called as get blob so it will actually convert the video return the data from this video to a blob object that's it 
so after you do this it's very simple this is now complete here and after this we need to create an object for the video so this will contain useful information about the video such as title description tags so we can give it a title for the video let's suppose i give here sample whiteboard whiteboard video so i give this title put a comma and you need to give a, a, a short little description this will be this is the description of the whiteboard video so put a comma and then you need to put a tax here out there so you can put a tax out there let's suppose surfing or send or we can simply say here whiteboard animation and also you can put a category id guys as well so there are different categories out inside youtube uh, technology education so you can just name just give it the category id as well so let me give it 22 so each category have a different number assigned to it so just read the documentation and depending upon that just give it so after you put this object guys we need to put the status of the video as well this will be again an object which contains a property called as privacy status so this can be either be public or private or unlisted so i will provide it as private you will see that sorry i think tax is category you need to put a comma here Uh, let me see why it is creating the problem and we paste it here <coughs> so um, let me paste this guys i think i have made a mistake here in writing this okay okay i forgot to enclose this yeah this is okay i need to surround this status property guys inside the category itself so that's why the error was coming so now you can see there is a status property here you can see that inside our video resource so this is our object guys which contains these five properties title description tags category id and the status of the video after you have this object guys you will simply insert this video inside youtube so we have a now we will interact with the youtube api so there is a youtube here and here youtube videos and this contains a method called as insert guys and basically this method takes our video object video resource and then basically it it returns the snippet and the status so whether the video is uploaded or not and then basically we will pass the name of the video the video itself which is contained inside source file that's it now you can console log the response coming from the api whether it's uploaded or not console logging it this is not complete guys so if you save this and before running this project guys uh, line number 11 some kind of error take place yeah that's that's because uh, i have spelled something not right this needs to be youtube youtube dot videos dot insert so simply save this so unexpected hmm. let me copy this you can see that insert and this I think you need to add the services guys here that's why it is creating a problem so now we need to interact with the google api so we need to add them it's so in the left hand side in the services tab you need to add individual service here which is first of all we will add the drive api that you see right here so this is a google drive api simply click on add so this will add your service of google drive so that you can use fetch the video file from the drive and also you need to add our uh, youtube data api simply click on add 
so this will also add the service here so upon adding this simply click on save uh, what is I think To paste there's some I think why it is creating so much error. Let me change the title. Sample whiteboard video. This is the description. so now if you click on save here so your project is saved guys so it was just a writing mistake so now if you click on the run option guys there is a run option to run your script and now it will ask for the permission so whenever you run for the very first time guys it will ask for some of the permissions to run so you need to allow those permissions if you want to run your project So you can see authorization required so click on this and basically it's your own project so simply go to advance and this will so it is completely safe and you can see it is asking you to give the permissions so see and download all your google drive files and manage your youtube account so that it can upload and delete files so simply click on allow and you can see execution started and basically after uploading it will return this object to us which is the thumbnail title which is if I now refresh it go to my video section you will now see sample whiteboard video so whatever title I given here you can see that now it is processing it and basically after processing it you can see private video is uploaded so in this easy way guys you can upload any video which is hosted on google drive directly to youtube using this simple script google app script that i shown you with the simple title description and you can even change the status to public private or unlisted so all the source code is given in the description of this video and please hit that like button subscribe the channel and i will be seeing you in the next video